And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Wednesday, May 27th, 2020. Now let's go to Miss Tucker. Good morning, Patriots. Miss Tucker here with your tip of the week. Patriots, please remember that this Friday is the last day that we can turn in assignments. If you are having difficulty with some of these assignments, please make sure that you're reaching out to your teachers. After Friday, there's not going to be another opportunity for you all to turn in your assignments. So please make sure that you're completing all that you can within this time frame. Have a good one. Back to you, Danielle. Thank you, Ms. Tucker. Now let's go to Jane to see what's happening today in history. Thank you, Danielle. Today in history, on May 27, 1950, Frank Sinatra made his TV debut on NBC's Star Spangled Debut. He went to, on to be one of the most famous, successful, and recognizable figures in music history. Now let's go to Nathaniel to see what to do today if you're bored and stuck indoors. Thank you, Jaden. Hello, Patriots family. Welcome to Things to Do if You're Bored. For today's activity, we're going to be making a paper peacock. This is what it looks like. Now here are the steps. Take three different color sheets of paper. Fold the first one like a fan. Apply glue to one end of it and put the two pieces together so it makes a semicircle shape. Then cut out two eyes of, out of white paper. Next, draw and cut out the shape of a bird. Then glue your bird in the center of the fan. Then cut a square base out. Glue your peacock to it. Cut out a beak for your bird, and then glue it on. Color the eyes on your bird, and then glue the bird back into the wings. Cut out some wings, and then color them in. Glue the wings to your peacock. All done! Wow! Wasn't that awesome? Now you have something great to display inside your house. Remember, if you do this DIY, send a picture or video to pines.renaissance at gmail.com. And don't forget to check in tomorrow for the next DIY and stay creative. Now let's go back to Danielle. Thank you, Nathaniel. Now let's go to Weather with Vani. Thank you, Danielle. Today's weather in Pemic Pines, Florida is forecasted to be 89 degrees Fahrenheit and thunderstorms. Now, let's go back to Samuel for the joke of the day. Thank you, Bonnie, and here's a joke of the day. One day, a little girl put her shoes on by herself for the first time. Her mother noticed that her left shoe was on her right foot. Honey, said the mom, I think your shoes are on the wrong feet. The little girl looked up and said, No, mom, I know these are my feet. Now let's go back to Danielle. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. That was a really good one. In admin announcements, teachers, please be on your emotive page to welcome your scholars in the morning. Attendance must supposed to be taken at some point each day. And lastly, teachers, please don't forget to provide our scholars with positive hero points. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. 
Congrats, Mr. Santiago, Miss Camelita, Mrs. Kuttner, Miss Anaya, and Miss Milholm. You had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, I go all around the world, but never leave the corner. What am I? The correct answer to the riddle was a stamp. Now for today's riddle. I add lots of flavor and have many layers, but if you get too close, I'll make you cry. What am I? Once again, I add lots of flavor and have many layers, but if you get too close, I'll make you cry. What am I? Teachers, please send your answers to pineslarenaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your responses to be reviewed. Winners will be announced the following day. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you a wonderful Wednesday. And remember, reset your mindset. Have a great day.